General Electric's unducted fan engine, a revolutionary aircraft propulsion system, is now undergoing proof of concept testing. This full-scale engine was designed and is being tested in cooperation with the National Aeronautics and Space Administration's Lewis Research Center. The two-stage counter-rotating unducted fan in this gearless system is directly driven by power turbines. The power turbine has two rotors. One is called the forward or outer rotor. The other is the aft or inner rotor. Each has six rows of blades. In a conventional power turbine, the forward turbine rotor would be stationary and simply guide the air into the rotating stage. Initially, the two rotors are assembled and balanced as separate components. The forward rotor drives the stage one fan blades, the aft rotor drives stage two. After balancing, the rotors are assembled as a complete unit to form the propulsor. Each turbine rotor is supported by a separate rotating power frame. Polygonal rings assembled to the power frames provide for attachment of the fan blades to the power frame. Trial assembly of the fan blades was made to perform a ping test to determine the natural frequency of the fan blades. The mixer frame, an air-cooled investment casting, has three main functions. It joins the propulsor to the gas generator, it supports the power turbines, and it is a main support for the entire engine. The propulsor, less the fan blades, was assembled to the mixer frame and the unit was prepared for shipment to General Electric's outdoor test site at Peebles, Ohio for its initial test run. In the prep to test area at Peebles, primary instrumentation was completed, a flight type nacelle was installed, and the UDF transferred to a transportation dolly. The unit was transported to site 4A and mounted into the crosswind facility where the fan blades were installed. The position of each blade was calibrated and the variable pitch mechanism was checked out. Nacelle panels were assembled to the engine to provide a proper airflow path into the fan blades. Late in the evening on August 29th, only two years after start of design, the unducted fan engine successfully completed its initial proof of concept checkout run to idle. Time is 21.51, air on. At startup, the fan blades are positioned at feather to prevent windmilling. They automatically rotate to the idle position during the light off to idle sequence. We have rotation on both propulsor fans. XN2 of 1400. XN25 to 5300. We'll activate ignition and open stopcock. Stopcock open now. We have a, we have a light. Start air pressure 36.4. Air off. In subsequent tests, the UDF demonstrated its ability to operate at full speed. And in a series of progressive tests, it has attained full power of more than 24,000 pounds thrust and an SFC of 0.24, a new world's record for turbofan engines. Over the next several months, the planned test program at Peebles will include mechanical integrity, performance, acoustic characteristics, and crosswind operation. Limited endurance testing will be run in preparation for Boeing 727 and McDonnell Douglas MD-80 flight tests.